What's going on guys? Welcome to Boogeyman 2. Yes, that is right. After such a long wait, we are now on the second game and Barry was actually kind enough to send me over a little bit of an early and advanced copy of the game to actually show off to you guys on the channel. So as you guys can see, first of all, just take a look at this, all right? The, the whole room's pink. The graphics looking amazing. This is obviously our room and we're going to get all oh, this is all oh, this is so exciting, guys. I seriously can't wait to play this. Of course, if you guys want to see more though, don't forget to drop a like on the video and if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe cuz there's going to be a ton more games like this. But let's just take a look around. So obviously, you've got a little bed here. It looks like we're playing as a little girl and uh, let's take a look over here so we've got some other youtubers here we've got 8-bit gaming Razbowski, invisa deer which i'm guessing that's aaron say what and job ja jabberwocky and then we also have corex kenshin right there but now let's go let's go in here all right i want to say a huge thank you to barry once again but look at your boy your boy is right here on a book fusion z gamer and it's like my little banner right there that is so cool along with some other people like the gaming salmon and uh invisa deer once again in sizzle games but yeah let's go ahead and get into the game here so obviously the same sort of you know start menu as the previous game we have nightmare night and a few other things here obviously continue a new game let's go ahead and get into a new game i seriously have been waiting for this so patiently for so long and to finally have it, it it's incredible all right so oh my god there's a little doll she talks to you i saw the gameplay trailer i know she does all right so what's gonna happen there's no flashlight yet i'm pressing f nothing's really happening so dude what is going on this is creepy okay so we've got a little uh little rabbit there you got a little fish Ooh. can i be your mommy no i can't i'm sorry that's a creepy voice. Worry, oh, Mommy. I can move now. I'm your friend. Oh my I won't god. Hurt you. you won't hurt me? You look like something from the pole. You have to tell me something. What? What do you have He's to tell? He's coming for you, Mommy. He's com who's coming? Oh god. Close, the boogeyman? Feel him. He can taste your fear. Oh my and god. I'm gonna hide in here. <laughs> okay, bright light, just like the last game. Okay. Uh. Something really bright. Is there something out here? No. Okay, I can't go out there. Uh, flashlight. We gotta find our flashlight again. Um, let's see. We've got some nice little lamps and stuff. Why don't we just use one of? The oh, there we go. Flashlight. You should hurry up and get what? back into bed. Okay. He's coming. Okay, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. A am I in bed? Oh, God. I think it's starting up, guys. It's loading it up. Oh, my God, dude. That's cool. Oh, here we are. Okay, we can't move anymore. Night one. Okay, so left trigger, obviously, to flash it. Uh, I don't know the button to look under the bed yet. It looks like, okay, there's a quick turn button, which is Q. I'm guessing E does the same thing. Um, whoa. He can train it away when you use it. What? Use your ears as well as your eyes, mommy. Use my Hear him before you see him. What? Once the morning light comes, he'll fade away. Okay, I. W this is. Oh no, dude. This is so much stuff I have to learn. I'm gonna die. I, if you right click, it takes you over to here. I don't know what this is doing. It's charging my batteries, but. I don't there's a there's a battery symbol over there. I don't know guys. Let's just play it safe. All right We're probably gonna end up dying multiple times. Luckily. What the heck? Oh, that's just a shadow. It looks like a finger Luckily, this is only night. Whoa, what is that? Okay, it's got he's got he's added some things that make it look like the boogeyman But they're not like that. I thought was his fingers and like a few other things. I thought were him too, but it's not Oh god, what what is going on? What's that noise? Oh, there he is. Oh, we've got that classic window attack right there. So far though, the lighting in this game is so good. That's one thing I would definitely say is like it's a nice lighted area. Like I love how that looks. I love how everything in the game looks so far. Okay, where where'd he go? So far he's only attacked from the window. I I'm worried that there's gonna be like under the bed jump scares, because in the previous game, I just can't see him getting rid of that. Wait, was he in the cause sworn I saw him in the closet. So the vent appears to be gone. I'm guessing he replaced it with that one now. And I'm not sure if he's going to appear under the bed anymore. I'm kind of glad if he did get under, like get rid of the whole under the bed tactic. I'm kind of happy about that because that was... Oh, God. He's what is that? He's coming through the vent. He, I can hear him taking off the screws. What do I do? No. Get away. Oh, God. No, no, no. Go go back. Go back. Um, I don't know what, what just happened there. He opened the vent. I don't, he didn't come through though. That is so creepy. Stay out, man. <laughs> Where's our timer? I don't know where. The, oh god, there he's at the window. 
I am excited. Oh, there's our timer right there. Okay, so it's 2 a.m. I'm excited to see what the boogeyman looks like now because he's shown one image of him on the Steam page, and he looks kind of creepy, but you can't really... Oh, there he's in the vent. You can't really see his face, so I want to see him, but I don't want to see him because obviously if we get to see the boogeyman up close, that means we're probably going to be dying to him. Okay, where is he at now? We're doing good, though, so far. I mean, we're almost at 3 a.m. It seems like it's going a little bit slower through the nights, but I'm not sure. I mean, it, it, that could just be me freaking out, but I guess we'll find out the more we play. And I think there's probably going to be five nights, just like in the other game, and there's probably going to be bonus nights. We already saw that there is Nightmare Night over on the menu, which I'm pretty excited to actually get into. That was hectic in the first game, so I can't imagine what it's going to be like in this one. Oh, God, where is he? He's not. He's not, he's, he's been gone for too long. I'm worried that he's going to come from under the bed. Because, like, that was in the previous game. I can't see him getting rid of that. But if you guys notice, he kind of kept all of the same sort of attack patterns, if that makes any sense. Like, in the previous game, he attacked from the door, he attacked from the window, the vent, and the closet. But he, like, changed it around. So the closet, instead of being in front of us, now it's over there. And the window's in the same spot. But the vent is now over there, which I actually like it over there a lot more. And the door is, like, shifted over to the side now instead of being um, where it was previously. Also, we have this chick with us, which... I, I don't trust her at all. Like, she knows the boogeyman. She said he can taste us. Like, she knows about him. Maybe she's, like, the ghost. Like, the spirit of, like, one of the other girls that died to him. Oh, God. That's... Okay, window. That's what I'm thinking, though. It's probably, like, the spirit of one of the past girls that died to him or something like that. And it's, like, in the doll. I don't know. It, it's creepy. If anything, she's probably going to end up becoming evil for all we know. I, I don't trust... Her. Oh, God. What is that? Vent? Got him. All right. Cool. The weird thing is he unscrewed the vent and then he opened it to, so like... It, with the other things, if he opens them, like, if he's about to open it and you stop him, like, he'll have to open it all the way before he gets in. So, with that, he, like, opened it, but I couldn't stop him. So, I'm not sure what's up with that. Okay, what's going on? Wait, what? What happened? Okay, uh, lights are going out. What is going on? What was that noise? I heard something. I can hear something. What the heck? Okay, I'm hearing new noises. Why is it playing that? Dude. Dude, are we about to die? I have a feeling we're about to die. Oh, no. I don't want that thing to stop. If that thing stops, he's going to jump out. That's like a jack-in-the-box from the previous game. That was Oh, okay. There it is. Okay, so we're fine. That's just like in the previous game, guys. It's just little distractions. He he's added in some new distractions. I do want to try charging our battery because I have a feeling that's what that's supposed to be behind us. So next time he attacks, we're going to go ahead and try to charge up our batteries here and hope for the best because... I'm worried, though, but I figure if we're going to test things out, night one is the night to do it, because this is obviously going to be the slowest night. Oh, my God. I keep thinking that tiki thing. Those look like the things from Crash Bandicoot, too. I keep thinking those are like him, though, for some reason. Like, it looks like his head. I don't know. Whoa, what? what is that? Oh, God, that was close. Okay, wind it up. Oh, okay, so that is to charge it. Okay, cool. It actually gave us one full charge as soon as we put him in. That's really good, though. Like, that's actually nice. So now we don't really have to worry as much about our flashlight. I mean, on the earlier nights. Like, the more we go in, obviously it's going to be harder to actually charge up these batteries. But so far, this is looking to be pretty good. All right, where is he at? Where is this man at? He's been gone for too long. What, what, oh, there he is. Okay, what time are we at? 5.34. We're about to beat it, guys. Less than 30 minutes until we complete night one. And then we get into the real game, the real challenge, starting at night two, which I'm pretty excited about. Come on, 15 more minutes, guys. 15. Oh, what is that? What? Oh, that was the vent. I, I was like, what the heck is that? It sounded like it was, like, down there. So I thought it was, like, some sort of new attack. I I, I figure it had the more, like, the more nights we get through, the more, like, he's going to attack more. And obviously, he's probably going to attack from different areas, too. Oh, there we go. 6 a.m. So I don't think he can attack us at this point. I think we're good. Yeah. It looks like we're fine. I like how there's more, like, it's... I don't know how to, like, a more, like, cinematic sort of approach he took to it now. I don't know how to describe it, if that makes any sense, though. All right, so now we're going to get to be able to talk to our chick again here. Let's see what she has to say. Night two. Are you going to say anything? You're just going to leave us to die? Oh, God. Whoa. I really want to tell your mommy and daddy, but it won't end well. They'll just make things worse. What? Also, I forgot to tell you that he can make you hear and see things that are not really there. Oh Don't no! Trick you. He can he can give us hallucinations. Oh no! Look, there's handprints on the window too. You guys see that? That wasn't there before, was it? Oh god, dude, we got handprints now. Somebody was trying to escape or something. I don't know. So wait, what kind of hallucinations can this guy give us? Oh no, dude, this is gonna be creepy. 
Uh, I, I hope this isn't like. I hope he doesn't like hallucinate himself like attacking. Oh no. Okay, no. I was gonna say, can he like? Because if he can do hallucinations or whatever, he could pretend that he's attacking here, but that might not actually be him, and he might be attacking from over there. Because if you guys remember from the previous game, there was like multiple boogeymans, so maybe that's what the other one was doing. I don't know. We really don't know, but that would be that's gonna be crazy if he can like have himself in multiple areas again. Because that that is when the challenge actually appeared. Because that's when it was like. You didn't know where to look. You didn't know, like, what to, like, you would look at the door and he'd be attacking from there. And you'd be so focused on that, but he would be coming from under the bed, too, at the same time. And he would just demolish you. And that was never very fun. All right. We got this, though. Where's he at? Oh, look at him. Look at him. I kind of want him to come in. Nope. You, you ain't allowed in yet, bro. <laughs> Not on my watch. I don't think so. So if I had to tell you guess, though, I'd say on this night, we're probably going to get a hallucination or, whoa, vent. Okay. Come on. There we go. So, yeah, we're probably going to get some sort of hallucination or whatever she was talking about. We're probably going to get an example of it. Now, one thing I'm kind of worried about, not really worried, but I'm wondering if there's going to be free roam in this one, too. Because in the previous game, we had that. And it came a little bit later on. I'm not sure if he's planning on adding it in or what, but I'm hoping he does. Because that was a very fun update, being able to roam around the house. All right, where is he at now? We just got him out of the vent. He doesn't really come from the door. Now I think about Have we even seen him? Oh, God. Have we even seen him once from the door? I don't think we have. I mean, the closet, he's, like, come, like, once or twice, but it's really only been the vent in the window. So this man needs to uh, expand his attack range. That'd probably help if he didn't just keep coming from the same two spots. <laughs> come on, man. You got to come from the door one time. I feel like something's going to come from this tent. Oh, what the heck? What was that noise? What is that? It sounds like crickets or something. Oh, God. Vent? Dude, it's getting... Oh, it's a snake! What the... What do I do? Uh, okay, I'm gonna charge up my batteries. I don't... I don't know what else to do. Dude, this thing's gonna attack me. What the heck? Okay, that... That's creepy. That's scary. Is Am I gonna get a snake jump scare? Oh, that was probably one of the hallucinations right there. I mean, well, yeah, you'd figure. Because obviously she doesn't have, a, like, a living snake in one of her boxes down there. So that was one of the hallucinations right there, guys. Oh, man, dude, that's creepy. Because I was really focused on that, so he could have attacked me right there. Wait, what was that? Okay, now I'm just hearing things. It's weird how these lights went out over here. I don't think he really comes... He doesn't even come from over there, so I don't know why those went out. This is, like, this is the easy part, though. Like, if you guys are seeing this and thinking, this game looks hard, no, you haven't, you haven't seen anything yet. It, it gets hard when we're probably going to have a bunch of hallucinations coming out at us. We're probably going to have multiple boogeymans, and the lights inside the rooms are going to go out, so it's going to be pitch black. That is when the game gets hard. We haven't seen anything yet. What time are we at? 3.44. Almost at that 4 a.m. mark and that much closer to completing night two. Uh, where is he? He hasn't attacked for a while, dude. Where are you at? This is worrying me. He, he's been gone for quite a while. I'm guessing... Everyone in the comment section down below, let's play this game again. We played this in the last game. Okay, so that one doesn't count. Everyone in the comment section down below, where do you think he's going to attack from the previous time? I'm going to say my answer in three, two, one. I think he's probably going to attack from... Okay, after, not counting that one. I think the next attack is probably going to be from the window. Because that's the two places where he's been always attacking from. The window and the vent. So, I mean, it's basically between either window or vent. I'm going to say window, though. Oh, what closet? Oh, he just got... Wait. Whoa, did you guys see that? He was wearing, like, a, a robe or something. What the heck, dude? That guy... <laughs> he looked like the dude from the end of Star Wars. What the heck was that? I don't know. Okay, so clearly he's some sort of, like, robed man now. Like, you can kind of see that from the screenshot he posted on Steam, but I don't know why he's wearing a robe. Uh, let's charge up our batteries. Almost at 5 a.m. The weird thing is we have more power on this night than we did on the previous night. <laughs> so, if anything, I'm doing better than I was. I'm doing better on night two than I was on night one. <laughs> I don't know, man. Our power has been pretty good. I've been pretty good at uh, conserving it. Oh, okay. That's not good. The ball fell, too. Oh, no. See, this is what I'm talking about, though. It's it's getting darker and darker. And once that light goes out, it's probably going to be pitch black in here. One thing I will say, though, like I said before, he's deaf. Oh, God. No, no, no. Get off the battery. Where is that coming from? Where was that? Oh, that's window. Dang. Oh, he was super late to opening it. I thought I was going to miss it, but nope. Oh, God. What is that? Okay, closet. That's fine. Dude, I don't trust this rabbit either. It, can, it looks so much creepier when the light goes out. That thing's probably going to come to life, too, as a hallucination. Oh, God. What is Vent. Got him. Come on. Go away. There we go. We're doing good. What time are we at? 5.35. Probably going to attack one more time, and then we're going to be good to go. Everyone, one more time. Comment which way you guys, he's going to attack from. I'm going to say window. Everyone, quick comment. Comment. 
because I want to know what, what you guys are going to say in the comment section down below. Come on, 10 more minutes. 10 more minutes, which is only like 10 more seconds. Where is he, is he going to attack at all? No, I think we're good. I think we're okay. Four more minutes, three more, and we got it. There we go. Nice. Oh, wow. I was actually shooting through my power very quickly right there at the end. All right. What the? Where's there a frog at? Oh, that's cool. It's a little like alarm clock. <laughs> alarm clock frog. And we have completed it. On to night three, I guess. Dang, dude. We're kind of shooting through this game right now. Not going to lie. I have a feeling, though, that this is where we're probably going to die. Oh, vent, 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 vent. Okay. This is probably where, where we're going to die at, though. so good, Mommy. Don't give up. Just keep fighting. I got you, all right? I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep fighting for you, all right? You, you creepy possessed doll. I'm going I'm to win this just for you. I got this. Don't you worry about a thing, all right? I'm going to... I don't I, I don't really know what, what I'm doing right here. I guess I'm trying to rescue you. I don't... I guess I'm just trying to survive. I have no idea. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Wait. No, no, no. I accidentally pressed that. No, no. Oh, what the heck, dude? He was not going back. I was just flashing at him. He was just like accepting it all right so already he's attacking way faster but what what exactly is the point of this chick i guess we're trying to save her i don't know <laughs> she's my pet doll all right i can't let her die i can't let the boogeyman get to her or me for that matter oh god no i keep oh my god dude the thing about this oh no oh okay i died i was just about to say the thing about this Dark oh mommy, try to look for the glowing eyes try to look for the glowing eyes what the heck is this we got a crow tree out here but the thing about my mouse is i gotta explain this because i know people are gonna be like how are you accidentally right clicking it's a really small mouse it's like for shooter games and stuff like that so the the buttons are like really close together and i just accidentally right click sometimes but uh what is go oh what the oh i pressed e and it like quick turned me i thought i like did something but now i don't know what's up with this so there's crows in a tree i don't know all right whatever let's uh Let's go back in again, I guess. So I got to make sure that I don't right click because if I do, well, we, we're going to die, obviously, to the boogeyman. All right, so let's try this out again, guys. Let's see if we can beat it. I mean, it, it seems like it's easy enough. I just can't right click. Whoa, what the heck? When was that? Has that always been there? Look at that drawing of the boogeyman right underneath the frog. So good, mommy. Don't give up. All just right. keep fighting. I got it, all right? I got it. Don't you worry, little doll, all right? I'll save us both. Oh, there you are. Get away. But yeah, that boogeyman drawing is new. There's no way that was there before. I would have seen that, right? I, either that or I'm completely blind. <laughs> Has that always been there? <laughs> Tell me in the conversation. Am I going insane or has that just now appeared? Because that is... I don't know. That looks new. Look, you can kind of see him, though. He's like a farmer-looking guy now. He looks like he's been working out in, like, the cornfield or something. Why does he look like that? He, I mean, it looks creepy. Don't get me wrong. But where is he? He looks like a scarecrow, kind of. It's actually really creepy looking. I, I want to see him because when he comes, when he starts to come through the door, if you guys remember from the last game, he walks up to you from the door. So, like, we'll be able to see a full body shot of him if he decides to, like, walk up to us from the door, which I'm pretty excited to see. Oh, window. There we go. Window's not really a big deal because he takes a long time to actually open the window. Okay. This one, on the other hand. It feels so close to my old one. What? She said, did she say she likes this body? I wasn't, I didn't get to hear that part. Dude, my headset's about to run out of battery. She said it feels close to her old one, though. So, uh, uh, obviously, she transferred bodies. That's creepy. <laughs> but also kind of, oh, God, okay. I didn't hear any sound effect from that. What the heck? I don't know. I get, okay, so she transferred bodies. We know that for sure is a fact now. So, she's probably from the previous game. I don't know. I didn't get to really, like, understand the storyline before I got into this. So, I'll have to go back and check it out. But I think... She's probably from the previous game, or obviously she's got, she's gotten murdered by the boogeyman. I'm guessing she has if some sort of relation to him. him. Maybe I'll tell you a secret, okay? Ooh, if we beat him, she'll tell us a secret. All right, there we go. Let's get rid of that one. So now we gotta be. I want to know the secret. <laughs> what the heck, dude? You can't just like. Oh god, that's creepy. Her legs look so lifelike. You guys see that? Ew, that's so creepy. Oh god, vent. Like, the rest of her looks like she's made of, like, stone or whatever. I don't know how to describe it, but, like, her legs just, they're moving and they look so real. Ugh, that's disturbing. <laughs> I like it, though. That's a cool little aspect to the game. I will say that. Oh, God. Okay, get get back in your closet, bro, all right? Did I say you could come out? No, I didn't. So stay in there. Oh, and by the way, this game is also Oculus Rift enabled. So 
If you guys would like to see me play that, comment down below. Oh god, where is he? Where, where is that? What is that? What did he just do? He like he turned off the light, but then he also came to the door. That is creepy to say the least. So that area is now completely dark over there. So you know what that means? If this light, what the? Oh, that door. He's coming from the door now. But you know what that means, right? If the if he turns off that light beside me. Oh no 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 no. Okay, got him. If he turned off this light, it's gonna be pitch black. Well, after that light, and then the game's gonna get really difficult and really scary too. So I'm not looking forward to it. Where is he? What is that? Oh, that's window. All right, now we just gotta wait patiently. Oh no no no! Oh what? It was that? I thought that light was already off. <laughs> I couldn't even tell that light did nothing. <laughs> I'm okay with that light turning off. You can you can keep that one off, bro. Keep that light. All right, just don't take the other ones. When it gets oh. too dark, mommy, try to look for the glowing eyes. Oh no! Are you kidding me? So that's what she said when I died previously. So his eyes, obviously, if I had to guess, glow in the dark. So, okay, that's good. So we're going to have, like, we're going to, oh, why does it say I have full battery? I don't think I, oh, I do have full battery. What? That was nothing. Where's the items in this game? In the previous game, there was items, but we don't really have anything in this one. So his eyes glow in the dark. So when all these lights go off, we're going to have to either rely off a of sound. While you were sleeping, I found some of these. What? I think they might help. Oh, as soon as I mention items. Oh, she's our little item girl. As soon as I mentioned it, though, she's like, yeah, I heard you talking about them. Here you go. Here's some items for you. Oh, God. Where's that? Where's that? Oh, no. Get away. No, my headset turned off. Oh, no. Guys, this isn't good. My headset ran out of charge. <laughs> this stupid Astros. This is why you get, like, a wired headset. You never get... Oh, no. no. This is not good. I have no way of knowing where he's coming from. And if she talks, I'm not going to be able to hear her. No, this is not good. I'm so screwed. <laughs> Charge it up a little bit. Okay, we're already fully charged. Whatever. Uh, where's he coming from? Guys, this isn't good. I mean, you guys can clearly hear, like, what's going on. But me, I'm, I'm lost in the dark right now. Literally. Uh, where, where is it? Okay. <gasps> no, he got in through the vent. He got in through the vent. Where is he? Okay, he just opened it. That's fine. He didn't come in. I, I've got to, I've literally got to check everything now until 5 a.m. I've got to be on. Okay, we're at 5 a.m. I'm until 6 a.m. I've got to be on the watch, guys. She's moving. She's rocking now, back and forth. That's not creepy at all. Okay, window. That's fine. You can come from the window. Just do not come from the vent. Because the vent, for some reason, you can't put a glow stick up there, unfortunately. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. Oh, no. He opened the door. Dude, he's opening everything. Come on, please, 6 a.m. I need to win this. Don't let me lose because I don't have sound right now. Oh, no, dude. Is he coming? Oh, okay. Let's just carefully check everything. I think we have enough power to do this, okay? So that's what that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I haven't I haven't seen him attack in a while. Where is he? Where is he? Is he just slow I feel like he's slowly like creeping up on me from somewhere. I think we're good. 548, 550. I think we have this in the bag. Come on. Come on. There we go. We got it. We got it. 550. Not bad at all. 6 a.m. That was very close and also very hectic because I thought for sure the fact I was going to die here, but I guess we didn't. All right. So, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to hear what she says here. Let me see if I can turn it on real quick, my headset. Is she going to say anything? Nope. We're just instantly going to night four. All right. Well, guys, I'm going to end this video here. We completed three nights in this video. Of course, if you guys want to see more of this game, be sure to drop a like on the video, like I said before, and comment down below that you guys want to see more. And I will see you guys... Wait, what? What? Some. What? Something. Wait, okay, pause the game. It didn't. It doesn't pause the game. What do we do? Okay, guys, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Something new is coming. I don't know what to do, guys. We're about to die. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out, guys.